Good morning everybody and welcome to Living Uniquely with myself Sharon Brown. I hope you are all doing well on this beautiful Friday morning. So I am coming in today just to allow we've had very very turbulent energies over the past two weeks and of course the energy peaked on Tuesday with the Lionsgate and a lot of people are finding it extremely hard to navigate through what's going on at the moment. So my suggestion is to literally just be if you feel like doing nothing do nothing if you feel like going for a walk go for a walk self-care is the most important thing that you can do for you at this moment in time so i'm just bringing in the drum bringing in a very very just that energy just to open up for you to receive what you need so it's about letting it all go and just really concentrating on you what you need and giving yourself the love and the self-care that you need at this moment in time. So we're just going to let everybody go and just coming into the heart and just opening up to receive. This is your time. Nobody else is just yours. So we're literally just going to come into you, center into you, ground back into ourselves and just allow that energy to flow to your body and do what it needs to do. So I'm going to ask you to take a deep breath in. So calling all your energy back from people, places, situations, time and space. So all the way back through that divine filter of pure love and light. So you're going to unhook and unleash from everyone and everything. Good morning, all. So all the way back through that divine filter of pure love and light. So you're unhooking and unleashing from everyone and everything. So all the way back through that divine filter of pure love and light and breathe out. Take another deep breath in. And allowing your energy to fully, fully drop into you. Your I am presence. Good morning, Vanessa. Your I am presence. Just dropping that all the way in. Into the here and the now. And breathe out. Take another deep breath in. Acknowledge how you're feeling, <clears throat> not wanting to change anything and letting go of that energy of expectation. Whatever that looks for you, just dropping that energy of expectation and breathe out. Take another deep breath in. And just bring your awareness to your heart. And as you bring your awareness to your heart, visualize three big golden roots coming out of your heart chakra, into your solar plex, into your navel, your sacral, your root, your hips, your legs, your feet, the floor, right down into your earth star chakra, through the dolphin matrix, into that inner cities, right down into that whale matrix and dropping into the core of Mother Earth. Feeling your energy and Mother Earth's energy combining as one and feeling this energy move up into your whale, your inner city, your dolphin, into your Earth Star Chakra. Pulling your Earth Star Chakra all the way down, down, down. Right down into that centre of the crystalline grid, all the way down, allowing you to fully, fully anchor your energy into your rightful place. Feeling your roots wrap around the crystalline grid. Fully, fully anchoring in your energy. And feeling the second part of the grid come up to fully seal in your earth star chakra. Feeling this energy move up into your feet, your root and your heart. Doing a 360 degree around your heart chakra. Now I'm calling in the energy from source. Pure, unconditional love of the highest vibration. Dropping right down into your Stella Gateway, clearing anything that's stopping you from having divine connection. 
into your soul star chakra so you can see, sense and feel your true soul's path and allowing that to fully illuminate in front of you. Into your causal chakra so your intuition can be fully heightened. Into the crown of your head so you can think more clearly. Into your third eye so you can see more clearly. Into your ear chakra so you can hear divine guidance. Into your throat chakra so you can speak your truth with pure love and light. Into the higher heart, connecting into that universal energy of 5D. And allowing you to anchor that within your life and body. Into your heart. So you can love you. You can see you. You can see <clears throat> your beauty inside and out. Into your solar plex so you can unleash your true divine masculine energies. Allowing them to fully balance within the body. And fully accepting yourself no matter what. Into your navel chakra so you can connect into that universal energy of oneness. Oneness to all. Connection to all. And allowing you to anchor that within. Into your sacral chakra so you can unleash your true divine feminine energies. Allowing them to fully balance within the body. And remember and reawakening your true gifts and talents who you truly are. Into your root chakra so you can bring in the abundance of life and all life has to offer. Into your hips, your legs and your feet so you can take any necessary steps forward right down into your earth star chakra and into the core of Mother Earth. Feeling this energy move up into your feet, your root and your heart. Doing a 360 degree around your heart chakra. Feeling your energy, Mother Earth's energy and Father Sky's energy combining as one. And feeling this energy move to every part of your body. Every part of your being. Allowing you drop right down into that stillness. Into that oneness. Into that zero point. Where nobody needs anything from you. Nobody wants anything from you. This is your time. And your space. So just allowing. 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 So just going to open up from that heart. Just receive what you need to receive at this moment in time.
Just allowing yourself to slowly, slowly come back. Slowly, slowly come back to the here and the now. Crossing your hands over your knees and just slowly, slowly come back because I definitely didn't want to come back. That was beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Yeah, Vanessa, I'm so looking forward to seeing you myself tomorrow night. I am so looking forward to tomorrow night, guys. I have my book launch, this beautiful, beautiful book. And I'm going to pull, a, pull, well not pull, I'm going to open up and see what we need, the guidance we need for today. So what number do we need? So it's very simple. Hold the book to your heart. 222 two, two is what I got. Animal number 222. Two, two. Commitment, the elephant. Look at that, beautiful. I'll read it out for you now. Beautiful, beautifully illustrated by Jenny Paris. I have come to you today to ask, are you truly committed to your dreams? Are you fully committed or are you allowing all the opportunities to pass you by? Yes, you can say you are committed, but then you don't do the action. We just allow it to pass us by. I feel you are doing this at the moment at this moment in time you are not sure what you really want and this is what is stopping you from moving forward sit down ask yourself what you truly desire and then make a plan of action you will be a hundred percent when you know what you truly want you will be a hundred percent committed dreams do come true dream it feel it and be committed and then i it will all fall into place and the affirmation is I am a hundred percent committed to my dreams so that's the beautiful message daily guidance that we received from the elephant today so it's all about committing to our dreams committing to ourselves and allowing ourselves to go to our next level and just be open to receive and of course most of all taking the action that we require so guys thank you for watching this thank you for watching the replay I will have the links up today um, I just have to set them, I have a few bits to do just to, and I will have the links up on my page, on my, um, on my page and they will be going through into my website. So, and anyone that is attending the book launch tomorrow will be able to get a copy if they choose to. So have a magical day guys. I have just a busy couple of hours now and I will talk to you all on Monday. So have a magical weekend and remember... To be 100% committed to you is about taking the action and allowing yourself to dream those big dreams. And you are the most important person in your life. So stay in your own lane. And remember, you are such a magical being. So take care. Bye. Have a magical weekend. Bye bye.